Grosvelli is showing a prototype here at NAB show, a new T2 Ultra HD. Alex, what's new with the latest T2 prototype? Yeah, so yeah, this is the uh, first showing of the uh, T2 4K prototype supporting uh, Ultra HD. Um, it's uh, basically, it has the functionality of the current T2 supporting uh, one in, two out for HD, but also it supports um, one in, one out for UHD, uh, uh, yeah, for UHD format. And regarding the frame rates, the old T2 has only supported up to uh, I-50 or I-60. How is it with the new T2? Yes, so the new T2 would support uh, 60p uh, with uh, Ultra HD and also uh, 1080, yeah, 1080 progressive. So it's a 3G solution if you're working with HD? Uh, with HD, it will be a yeah, 3G solution supporting uh, HD, uh, HD 1080p. Yeah. And uh, when working in Ultra HD, uh, you can choose between one player uh, or one recorder, right? Correct, yeah. yes. Either one in or one out. And the flexibility that T2 gives is normally that you can use all different kind of video formats uh, which uh, the T2 can read and support. Uh, many players in the industry, uh, when you come with a yeah, XAVC file or with a MPEG file or something, they simply wouldn't play it. They need a sp specially defined file. How is it with the T2? Yeah, so with the T2 too, it can play back many type of uh, generic file type formats, um, QuickTime and MPEG formats. Um, to play out, so yeah, that would be the case um, in T2 being able to support um, those various types of files. So when it comes to control uh, the T2, what options do I have? So you'll be able to control the T2 via like AMP or DHCP protocol. Um, also it will support uh, RS-422 control via, uh, uh, I'm sorry, uh, yeah. RS-422 control from other outside devices. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, I see I have a jog shuttle here, and uh, is this display, is it a touch screen? Yes, so basically these uh, front panels are working the same way as uh, the current T2 does. It's a touch front panel with uh, jog shuttle, uh, um, uh, how do you say, um, playback and rewind control. And is it possible to use the T2 also in a desktop version? Uh, yes, so you can connect a monitor and a keyboard yeah, okay. to use this application uh, like a Windows desktop. Yeah. So basically the new T2 is like the old T2 but with uh, 60p support for HD uh, and if it comes to for Ultra HD then you, it's uh, reduced to just one, the usage of one channel in or out. In UHD 60p, yes. When will the new T2 be available? Uh, it's scheduled to be available uh, towards the end of the year, around September, October, IBC time. Okay, so then we are looking forward to see uh, the new T2 at IBC 2018. Yeah, that's correct. Yes. Thank you. Yes.